Ready to plant a tree. First thing we need to do, dig a hole about three to five times the diameter of the root ball. We dig it to the proper depth. Here we're right at the soil level of the container. So to get it out of the container, I just lay the container down, press on it, roll it around a little bit. That'll just loosen the soil. Carefully remove that root ball. Gonna brush away a little soil from the top just to expose the root flare. That's gonna tell us the exact spot we're going to plant this tree to the right height. And examining this tree, it looks like it's in pretty good shape. There aren't really circling or girdling roots to deal with. And then we're going to just slowly work soil in around this root ball. Gonna double check the height. This is where I am and this is where I should be. So this hole is a little deep. If you dig the hole too deep, and you add loose soil into the bottom of the hole, eventually that soil will settle and your tree will sink down a little bit and it'll end up a little too deep. So if you do dig a hole a touch too deep, go ahead and plant your tree a little bit higher than you normally would. So when it settles, it'll actually settle into the proper depth. We did not add any organic material or fertilizer at the planting. Um, sometimes doing that will encourage those roots to just stay within the planting hole. Our first watering, we want to really soak this tree good. Uh, the water will help the backfilled soil fill in any air pockets, get the roots in good contact with the soil. And we sure don't want this young tree that we just put in the ground to be drought stressed. After we've watered our tree, we're going to create this mulch ring that's going to help the soil conserve moisture, keep it from losing water to evaporation, keep maintenance equipment away from this tree. And that's our last step. This is Chris Hilgert, University of Wyoming Extension. You're watching From the Ground Up.